When Your Daddy's a Soldier, written by Gretchen Brandenburg McLeland and illustrated by E.G. Keller. When your daddy's a soldier like mine, you want to be a soldier too. You wear camo like he does, you wear dog tags like he does, and you want to ride in a tank or a helicopter just like he does too. When your daddy comes home from work, you race to unlace his big boots and yank and pull until they pop off. You put them on and march around while his happy toes wiggle. But sometimes your daddy doesn't get to come home from work. Sometimes he has to go away and you can't be with him. When he tells you this, you want to stick your fingers in your ears and never take them out. When your daddy's a soldier, sometimes he gets ordered to work far, far away for a maybe forever long time. Our daddy is going to war. Sis cries, but I try to act like a soldier, brave. Daddy says he's proud of me, but his voice sounds lumpy. Later, I hide in my fort and cry. Before daddy leaves, he places his favorite hat on my head. Then he tells me I'm the man of the house now and to take good care of mama and sis. But after he's gone, I don't sit in his place at the table. His chair is so empty my throat hurts. Sis still sets up a place for him. Mama doesn't eat. I tell her a joke to make her smile then sis does too. When your daddy's a soldier far away at war, your mama's not the same. Sometimes it seems like she's gone too. Sometimes you have to jump up and down before she even knows you're talking. Sometimes she expects you to be all grown up and others, she acts like you're a baby again. And sometimes you do things you did when you were really little, like twirl your finger around and around in your hair or sleep with your lights on again. We draw pictures and write letters to daddy. My class writes letters too. We thank him for his service and invite him to visit our school when he comes home. Daddy writes back that he puts the letters up where he can see them, right next to our pictures. His buddies say he's lucky to have such a great family. We send him other things too. Sis sends her favorite seashell so daddy won't forget the sound of our ocean. I send him a skipping stone to carry in his pocket. Daddy and I found it right before he left and promised to watch it fly when he gets home. I don't want him to forget. I tell Mama I want to mail myself too. Then Sis copies me. Mama laughs and says we can bake his favorite cookies instead. When your daddy's a soldier like mine, a day comes that's better than all your birthdays and holidays put together. That's the day you hear that your daddy is coming home. At the airport, we wait and wait and wait for day. And then we see him. Sis and I take off running. And then mama is there and I don't think she will ever stop kissing him. When they finally stop, Daddy spins Sis in a hug around and around and then swings me up on his shoulders. Together, we are bigger than anyone in the whole wide world. At home, Daddy's chair is full again and we have fun, fun, fun. We have a slumber party and play games and eat lots of ice cream. Daddy can't get enough ice cream. He says the war is always hot. Daddy tells us he's proud of the way we've taken care of one another while he's been gone. He says we should get a medal for keeping our family strong.
Daddy gives us camo backpacks with his mission and unit patches on them. I show mine off to everyone at school. My teacher asks me how I'm feeling. Happy, I say. My daddy's home. That's joy, honey. Joy. And her eyes shine. When daddy visits our school, we have a special assembly to honor him and all veterans. Sis and I stand tall next to daddy on the stage. But when your daddy's a soldier, he doesn't get to stay home for good. He has to go back to his unit, back to the war. This time when he leaves, daddy holds me so tight that I don't think either of us will ever let go. Daddy makes a joke about me being Velcro boy and peels me off. Softly, he says, chin up, son, I'll be home again. He ruffles my hair, shoulders, his bag, and walks away. Then he turns around one last time and waves goodbye. When your daddy's a soldier like mine, you wish you were big and brave enough to be a soldier too, so you could always stay together. For now, you do your best to be brave and strong during the day. You pray that your daddy will come home soon. And at night, you dream of peace. <laughs>